Hey guys, Dana Card Tech 710 here, and I have just a one card mail day for you, for you, but I promise it's a good one. I went on vacation to Vegas, and I totally even forgot about I had this thing coming. I don't know how, because I was too excited about going to Vegas, but very pleasant to come home and pack pretty well, as can be expected. Six Miller Huggins in SGC six. Just a gorgeous card. Um, this is part of my Hall of Famer portrait sets in uh, high grade or as high grade as I can get. But uh, I paid a little bit of a premium on this. But and I don't necessarily think that an SG SGC six is necessarily the equivalent of a PSA six. But still, this one, this card, I I challenge anyone to find fault with it. I mean, this is nice corners, perfect centering uh, all around. Just a gorgeous, gorgeous card. Um, Miller Huggins was a decent player, but more importantly, in his uh, latter years, he was actually the manager of the Murderer's Row Yankees, the 1927 Yankees. So, um, died pretty young too at the age of 51 due to like an infection or something like that. But, um, Maybe you guys know because the centering for this is fantastic. The corners, I think, are pretty good for a car that's 108 years old. But uh, how much does the the back actually matter? Because this one's really off center on the back, but perfect centering in front. I know that um, if there's paper loss, it definitely affects the grade. But maybe you guys can comment below on on how much does the centering on the back of the card, particularly tobacco cards, actually does it actually matter? Um, let me put a back, back backdrop in it. that way you can see it a little better. But just look at this. So one card, a uh, heck of a card. I am not going to be sending this to PSA to get cross graded. I think it's perfectly fine in the SGC case, and I really like this uh, the classic SGC case. I'm not a real big fan of the new ones with the giant number number there, but. Uh, T206 is in particular because of the, maybe because of the size and the borders, it just looks really good in the SUC holder. So that's it. Um, another Hall of Famer portrait in high grade. So uh, tell me what you think, guys. Until next time, thanks for watching.